Hello! Hi! Hello! Howdy! Welcome to the Brian Scout channel. If you stumbled across this video, um, I'm sorry. If you're curious about this channel, uh, this is our first video, actually. I'm Brownie Scout. I'm the guy who created this channel, so... Anyway, uh, this, this channel is uh, primarily going to be, kind of, I guess, like a gaming channel, but also probably do a variety of different content um, as well. But yeah, so today, today though, we are playing a game. We are uh, uh, playing this game right here called uh, Breath Edge, called Breath Edge. Um, I know, I know what it says on the screen. I know it, it, it may look like it says Eat Hedge, but um, it in fact is actually called breath head breath hedge breath edge not breath hedge either breathage Bre breathage breath edge breath edge breath edge breath edge anyway um yeah today we're going to be playing breath edge let's let's get into it From the creators of the Matrix, there's been no news lately. <laughs> what? Why are they mentioning 22 awards that some other games have received? Searching for this font to go path development time. I wow. Okay, uh, that exudes confidence. It really, really helps me be confident that this is going to be a good game. You know, I mean, hey, the font's great, which this is a decent font, right? The Red Ruin Softworks team is categorically against smoking, which causes loud headlines in newspapers and other diseases. And therefore, we suggest that you replace this dangerous cigarette in the robot's claw for something more useful. Well, I here on the Brownie Scout channel, we are all about censorship. So let's uh, let's go ahead and block out the cigarette. We don't need to see that. That's gross. Here it's you a carrot. <laughs> Did you have time to think of how to behave during the interrogation? Remind him, R2-D3. Remind me. Oh, okay. Um, I guess we just beat Tell people now. No from the beginning. No lie. Confirm. Uh, put on a defiant expression and spit in the face of this piece of iron. Yeah! Or spit in your helmet, I guess. You tell Damn. us all from the beginning or violence. You tell us that you fly to the funeral, but the liner explode radicals of green universe. Confirm? Um, spitting was a lousy idea. We agree. You better tell the story first. You can still have a defined expression. Hmm. Nope, I'm going to spit again. With my little windshield wiper. <laughs> and I get smacked again. You tell us all from the beginning or violence. You tell us that you fly to the funeral, but the liner explode radicals of green universe. Confirm? Well, spitting was a lousy idea. Maybe, uh, maybe we should move on. <laughs> Eventually this game has to go on, right? Oh, <laughs> And apparently I'm on the BDSM fan club. But the liner explode radicals of green universe. Confirm. Um Let's see how many times we can spit on him before uh I don't know. Let's just see if we can keep spitting on him at this point. We've already we've already established ourselves as some some rebels, you know. We 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 don't like smoking. But, uh, we're also not gonna let violence. someone tell us what to do. You tell us that you fly to the funeral, but the liner explode radicals of green universe. Confirm? Hmm. Nope, doing it again. He pissed me off. Destroy. Oh, that's different. Oh. And roll credits! Okay. Um, well... 
I guess it's the end of the game. This time we're gonna do it again. I'm gonna tell him, uh, actually tell him the story, and then uh, maybe, maybe we'll move on, or we'll just get get beat again. So let's uh, let's try it again. Can I not skip this? Okay, so we're back at the title screen. Um, obviously, we just uh, got our asses beat by a couple robots. So uh, probably this time we shouldn't spit on them. We should probably just move on with the story. But uh, yeah, let's give it a shot again. Uh. Oh, God. This is nasty. Here you are again. Did you have time to think of how to behave during the interrogation? Mm -hmm. Remind him, <laughs> yep, let's go ahead and tell him. Year 2073, somewhere in the outskirts of the universe. In space. Wow. Just... Just appeared. Interstellar liner, unnamed. Your yogurt or some other... Gar... Uh, garbage ads. Oh. I guess... Advertising space. Nice. Oh. Oh. That. Who's that? Is that my dad? Who's that? I guess I knew him. That's sad. Green Universe Broccoli Attack. Oh shit. No! Oh, and we crashed. Nice. Just crashed. Breath Edge. Chapter 1 Lost in Space. See, I told you it's Breath Edge. You lied to me. Oh. Logo was impossible. God damn. Not see the shuttle from space. Tell truth. No lie. Confirm. I wasn't. Okay. Sure. Apparently I lied. Nope. Still got sucked up. Ew. Who left their gum? Who just leaves gum lying around? Greetings. I'm your funerary spacesuit built in guy. And I got a chicken. Before we start communicating further, confirm that you are still able to read after the impact. How do I confirm that I can still read? Okay. Splendid. Oh, you've gotten okay. into a non-standard situation. The Breath Edge Global Funeral Agency is proud of its impeccable history. However, your death may cause the loss of its reputation. Therefore, we suggest that you stop the gas leak and survive. Oh, okay. I'm glad. I'm glad they're worried about like me surviving. Because of their reputation, but I guess that's uh, I guess it's any business. It's any corporation, you know Let's uh, let's plug this hole. Oh With a chicken. I'm sorry. I'm sorry chicken an object without any holes Okay, I need something without holes. I guess I should just go and grab stuff What is this? Is this, this is the gum. Wait, nope when okay. picking up any useful items, you, you got can the stuff gun. them in your pockets, calling it an inventory, if you will. I'm just gonna keep. I'm just floating around. All right. What does that mean? All right. So. Take out the chewing gum from your pocket. Oh. Okay. Chewing you gum. To get your funerary spit stick it somewhere, except for your face. Okay. What do I do? Oh, I guess I got. I guess I'll use the gum to plug the hole. Take chicken out. Um. And plug this. You deserve some okay, words of encouragement. Woo! You've almost won. Woo, we almost won, guys! The funerary spacesuit isn't designed for long term use of persons or animals in outer space. It is recommended to immediately call for help on the interphone, improve the spacesuit, or become depressed. Or become depressed. Okay, so I guess I gotta fix this interphone, or, or check the interphone. Let's check the interphone. Just the antenna. You'll have to go into outer space. It. Okay. To outer space. I guess I don't need a tether or anything. Radiation is detected. Probably this is the central core of the liner. Be careful. The radiation will kill you instantly in such a suit. Oh well, that's good to know. Um, 
Let's find this antenna. Is this the antenna? That was a close call. Try to adjust the antenna very carefully. You've got great engineering oh. skills. You have broken the antenna completely. Nice. You'll need special equipment and interphone activation codes, which are encrypted in the memory of the steering wheel, if it's still intact. Okay. Well, uh, what is this? I think this is the it steering wheel. It looks like wheel. the steering wheel. You need to try to connect to it. How do I connect to it? Like a, on an emotional level? Do I like talk to it about its feelings? Great news! Using my ingenious two-digit password matching algorithm, I managed to hack the interphone activation codes. Now Good job, robot. Now all build a cryptographic debugging station and reconfigure the interphone using these codes, which will take about five years with your current skills. Sweet. Okay, so let's. What are these? Is it in tools? Okay, cryptographic debugging station. Cryptographic debugging station. The most sophisticated professional equipment for disturbing, or distributing. I can't read. Distributing streaming information with cryptographic encryption over internal software networks. There's nothing more to add. Oh, there's nothing more to add. Okay. Uh, obviously, I can't read um, because of the crash, you know. The principle of this operation is classified as the government, by the government, as the blueprint of the device is a more complicated than the blueprint of the flying saucer. Okay, so apparently it's a very complex piece of machinery. Um, let's use the processor, I guess, to figure out. Okay, I need two pieces of metal and a wire. Okay, so I'm assuming all that I'm going to have to find out there. Oh, metal. Cool. I'm like halfway there. What's that? Is that a mug? <gasps> I could use it for my coffee. The sensors report the presence of some nearby cooling gel. Its microscopic particles can settle in the glass of the spacesuit, forming some beautiful frost work, which can lead to visibility deterioration. Nice. Sweet. So I got all our metal. Now I just need to find by the primary analysis wire. Of structure, most of the passengers of the liner died. This might be the biggest catastrophe in the history of astronautics, the reasons for which are yet to be clarified. Well, that's reassuring. Glad we know that. Oh, wire. Sweet. I got plenty of wire and metal. So let's go back in here. Um, equipment, tools, and we made it. Yay. Let's equip it. And then... Wait a damn minute. Sure that this is exactly what was on the blueprint, then try to reconfigure Bruh. the receiver. If you have any doubts concerning it, then you will eventually suffer an electric shock, and then your spacesuit will automatically take your body measurements to order a coffin from our company. Thank you for choosing the Global Funeral Agency. This is... This is the debugger? It looks like a stick. Well, let's try it. Oh. I guess it worked. Attention to all survivors. A rescue shuttle Hope has been sent for you the from the... Oh. exceeds your estimated lifespan by 4,369 years. You need to get to the extraction point yourself, getting past the radiation. However, it's impossible to do this with your current skills. To increase your level, you need to create some crap imposed by the developers. Wait. 4,000... Wow. That's... That's far. That's a long time. I don't think I'll survive that long. What do I need to make this... Crap imposed by the developers is under tools. No. Oh, here we go. Crap imposed by the developers. Actually, some crap imposed by the developers. Well, cool. Uh, that's reassuring. I'm glad I'm using my time and resources to build this. But if it gets me through the game and I need it, bait, what, who's this? Incredible, survived one. I see your avatar online. Um,. It wasn't possible to determine the coordinates of the survivor. Communication only works on reception, which gives a good reason not to respond and not to be distracted, despite the objections of the hormonal system. The hormonal system. Can I? So I shouldn't. So I shouldn't go after her. I need refined metal wire and thick electrical tape. So what? how do I find refined metal? What's the difference? Okay. Refined metal shines 10 times brighter than unrefined metal. It's hard to find any other differences. I'm... Once again, I'm baffled by just how I just how resourceful we are in in this game. 
I need four metal to make a, a piece of refined metal. And I need two of those, so I need eight metal. Can't read, but I'm good at math. And uh, I need thick electrical tape, which how do I do I find that too? Babe, my name is Babe. I am very beautiful. You save me, I beg. I am completely alone. Take off your helmet. You may hear me cry. Hurry. Why would I take? Computer has very sweet accent, causing fatal errors in my grammatical functions. She wants me to take my helmet off. That sounds dangerous. Now let's let's go find more metal, so that I can then make this crap imposed by the developers. That's metal. Hey, metal! Yay, metal! We're gonna get more. Nope, I think that's too far. Run out of air. One, two, three, four, five, eight, three more. Oh, come on. I just need one piece of metal. Oh, there it is. Sweet. I got the metal. I got enough metal to make two pieces of refined metal. All right. So I see dangerous place on the radar. There are many life giving oxygen. You cannot fly there. If you suddenly smoke there, you can explode. It is better to suffocate than to burn. Well, joke's on you, lady. We don't smoke here. We eat carrots. So take that. I'm not going to blow anything up because you can't blow things up with carrots. Stupid. Let's make some refined metal. I got one. Can't read, but I'm good at math. Fuck! <sighs> it was just one short. It was just one short. I just need one piece of metal. There it is. All right, sweet. So I got I got my two pieces of refined metal. I still need thick electrical tape. So I got to figure out where I find that or how I can make it. Something along those lines. So I'm going to go fly around for a second and see if I can find electrical tape. Oh, I need to break it? Wait, what is that? There you are still. Oh, where'd it go? What did she just say? Shit. Oh, okay, here we go. What did she say? Are you still alive? I cannot name my coordinates, but there are debris here and there is debris on your left and you have to help. I beg you. Quick, fly to me through the radiation. I don't... Didn't they say this suit doesn't prevent radiation? Like, doesn't block radiation? I think that might kill me. What's that? Roll of fabric. Okay, well, I got some fabric. I don't think I necessarily need that. I got a grabber. Oh, what's this? Oh! Oh, I got the blueprint for thick electrical tape. So what do I need for the thick electrical tape? I need two rubber. And I got one rubber. That's what I just picked up. So, more fabric. Yay! So... I gotta figure out how I can find more rubber. I think I need to build something. I think I saw the, it was, was it a handy scrapper? I probably need to build one of those. What do I need for a handy scrapper? Handy scrapper, I need uh, three metal. All right, how much metal do I have? Zero, because I use it all for refined metal because we're very resourceful in this game. Forgive my accent. Humanity fly all over the galaxy, but never make good translator. Are you saving me? Uh, not right now. Uh, take a number. We'll get to you as soon as possible. But right now, I need to save myself. So I don't die. Oh. Or another pillow. For fabric. Cool. We just made a handy scrapper. So now we can go break things. Because I'm all about breaking stuff. Yeah! Yeah, let's break stuff. Yeah! Yeah!
More metal. So break big ball of metal. Get small metal. What are these? Nutrition package. Oh, okay. I'm assuming the nutrition package is for food. So I can make a water bottle and a nutrition package. What is that? Plastic. Cool. There's something else. What was that? No, come back. Where? God, they make stuff so small in this game. Where'd it go? Okay. Well, uh, whatever that was. I hope it wasn't rubber. That's what I need. So now we can we can make food, so that we can eat and we can make water, so we can drink, so I won't die. Because that's always a concern. You always, you get, make sure you eat and drink water. Okay? It's important. It's important for your health. It's important for my health. Oh, wow. Someone just left some water bottles lying around. And a nutrition package lying around. Oh, and some alcohol. Nice! Woo! We're getting, we're getting lit tonight! We're gonna have a party! Break open. What's this? Alright, another piece of metal. Babe, um, so, the yeah. On my monitor, signals... Of the rescue shuttles appeared right at the point, but no one answered. Probably their danger there is not worth flying. Oh, and I got a battery. Nice. I'm about to start ignoring this lady because uh, I feel like she's just telling me stuff and trying to get me to die. Oh, sweet. Thick electrical tape. Yeah. All right. So we've got... Our let's go tape, we've got a refined metal, and we got our wire. So let's go ahead. Let's build this crap imposed by the developers. Sweet. I guess I gotta equip it. And it said put it put it in your hands. Nice! Not wow. The electrical stimulation is complete. I wish all games were... your brain's activity while you were. Oh my god, what is that? Oh my god! What is that? Working, your brain was stimulated with small electrical charges to improve your engineering skills. Judging by the result, it didn't work and caused a number of hallucinations. However, it was entertaining. You still can't get past the radiation, but I will mark the coordinates of the rescuers for useless motivation. Sweet. I uh, yeah, I definitely feel like that's not how stimulating your brain works or, you know, getting better at things, but yeah. Hey, let's uh I can hit myself. Oh, Oh, it actually takes my health. Okay, I won't hit myself anymore. Let's uh, let's install this somewhere. This nice piece of work. Ooh. Nice piece of artwork for the living room. Is that? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This looks like something. <laughs> All right, what's next? All right, I should probably uh try and get my health back. If I eat, does that get rid of it? Drink water? No. What is this? Okay, let's rest. Let's take a nap. Oh, okay, and getting rest heals you. As it does in life. Make sure you get rest. Make sure you sleep. It's important. Don't stay up all night, okay? Playing video games like some people. I didn't ask you. Don't don't call me out like that. What am I doing now? Get to the evacuation point. All right, where's this evacuation point? That looks far. Well, I guess we'll uh, go explore around. Try and figure out what I need. What's over here? Be careful with the vacuum breakdowns. An electric shock of such power can lead to the failure of my systems, and I can't guarantee the safety of your corpse before the arrival of the funeral team. I want to go home, please. Okay, so I don't want to get near them because I'll get electrocuted, but also, I guess Babe is saying, is trying to convince me with her large bust and slender legs. I gotta go save her now. Well, I don't want to get electrocuted, so... Oh, I can... How do I neutralize it? Oh no. <laughs> okay, poor chicken. But it's better that the chicken gets electrocuted than I than I do cuz uh 
I don't want to die. Chicken dielectric. <laughs> Another achievement. Sweet. Let's break open these things. Oh, I got a condom. I mean, that's, you know, hey, safety. Safety first, kids. Or adults. You should be adults. Safety first. I guess I should probably build the spacesuit. I would assume that I need a better spacesuit if I'm going to try and make that trip to the pickup point. So, I don't know how to get glass, lead paint, lead, uh, lead, 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 lead paint, or aluminum. And I don't know how, I'm assuming a roll of fabric is just combined fabric. Yeah, roll of fabric, I just need four fabric. So, and then lead pa paint and aluminum. So, the aluminum and lead paint and glass, I don't know how to get. But, I have found con a condom already. I've obviously got wire. I, I have plastic. And I know how to make thick electrical tape. So, let's, let's start, I think, with the oxygen balloon. Toilets detected. Some of our clients are very sensitive about toilet talk, and therefore we included a dictionary filter which will replace the word feces with the word joy. <laughs> is this, wait, is this the toilet? Is this what he's talking about? The largest condom in the world, and also an emission of gas, most likely oxygen, are detected ahead. Oh, nice. There's no data on the condom being suitable for an oxygen reservoir, but you can try to construct a simple balloon for distracting yourself from fatal thoughts. The service supply compartment, almost intact. They usually install oxygen stations here. You would be oh, able to, to get inside. Well, let's try to get inside. Break the door down. Hey, damage Let me scanner. in. You can scan the scanner with a scanner to record the scanner's damage data. The scanner scanner protection system for emergency depressurization of the compartment. Shit. You will need a scanner. I used the word scanner eight times. That's, oh God, I, I might die. Shit, 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 shit. <laughs> no! <laughs> ah! Okay, thank God. Well, that was something. That was something else. I almost died. It was crazy. I think I'm going to go ahead and rest. And then I think I'm going to call it for this video. I'm going to keep, keep this one going for a little bit. See how far we can get. Next time, we'll be working on the spacesuit, trying to figure out where to get the resources we need for that and the oxygen balloon. Thanks for coming out. Thanks for watching the video, guys. This is a lot of fun. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, please uh, please hit that like button and also, uh, also sub bleh, subscribe to the channel. I'm going to be putting out more of this here soon. Probably put out another video here right after this one. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, I will see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. Get out. Go. Go do something else. <laughs>